All right, hey everybody. This is Wired Wednesday, where the only thing wired is the host. Yes. <laughs> this time joining me on this episode, we have uh, my lovely assistant, Casey. Hello, everyone. How's he doing? All right, so, Casey, what is the most fucking annoying, goddamn irritating grading problem there is on the internet? Um, feminist. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I, ads. Ads. <laughs> because what happens every time we try to show people a picture? Yes, it ads. is so annoying. They it is... take it over. They take over the website. They reload stuff that you don't want to load. Ads. Yeah, like when I'm trying to read a story and I don't even click anything. I just start scrolling and then like another thing comes up. I hate those videos that will just start playing. They scare the crap out of you because your volume's too high and you didn't realize it. Uh, the ones that get me the most are the ones that take over the entire screen. And, mm. and they're not like pop-ups. Like, you used to be able to use a pop-up blocker. Yeah, and they make the close button, like, really tiny yeah. so you can't find it. Oh, I hate that. Fuck me. those people. <laughs> Fuck that shit. But there's a solution, and those are ad blockers. And I'm a big fan of ad blocking, but I'm also a content creator. We make this show happen, and we have Theaterverse.com, which is also run by ads. Uh, but there's a way around this. You can get uh, a new ad blocker that's come out called Our Data, where if you are giving away your information, they compensate you for it, as well as compensating the content creators. So the way Our Data works, and you can go and see this for yourself at rdata.us. There you go. Uh, that's the name of the site. And uh, what they do is if, if you sign up soon, you get 10,000 free shares. Uh, after that, you can, after their little sign up period here for the 10,000 new members, you only get 9,000 shares. Anyway, for every share you get, uh, they will pay you a little bit when they start getting their uh, contracts made with these advertisers. Mm -hmm. So instead of blocking all the ads, It'll block the ads from people who haven't decided to come on board and compensate you for your information. Oh. So it has like a, uh, I don't know what you would want to call it, like like a, crap, I can't think today, like not a reward system, but like. Well, it's a sharing system. Yeah. Uh, so the way it is, is it blocks the ads as long as you use Chrome or if you use an iPhone. Uh, Android's coming down. Also, oh, it works on phones too. Yeah, yeah. Oh. It well, it works on iPhones. iPhones have ad blocking available. Oh, okay. Android still kind of doesn't unless you root, and that's another story. But anyway, it's supposedly <laughs> coming to Android. I don't know how they're going to do it yet. If I had to guess, probably through a VPN. But anyway, uh, what they do is every advert advertisers make billions of dollars every year off of your information, your shopping habits, where you go where you browse, and there's no reason why you as a person should not be compensated for that product. Mm -hmm. So our data is trying to uh, make it so that you can be. Uh, it doesn't cost anything to join. All you have to do is uh, create an account. It's right here at the top of the page. See, if you go up here, create a free account. You click there, and then you can uh, sign up. And uh, I'll have a link to it here in the video description for this one where you can use it. It'll, uh, full disclosure, it'll be my affiliate link. If you uh, happen to sign up, then you get your own affiliate link. You get your friends to sign up under you. Kind of pyramid scheme sure, but <laughs> uh, it means you get more <coughs> shares. So when you view ads, once the, all the deals are in place, once the ads start appearing, it means you'll get a little bit more money than somebody who has less shares. That's all it is. So you just gotta have gotta sign up. You have to give them a phone number just to prove you're human. So you do that. You install the ad blocker, and uh, it does a pretty good job. It's based on it's based on a uh, uh, uBlock Origins, which is already a fantastic ad blocking software. So uh, it does just as good as that one does. And once these companies have signed on, then you're gonna be good. Uh, yeah, this seems uh, very interesting. Right? <laughs> uh, do you know? Um, like I know Twitch is a huge, like, um, site now. A lot of gamers, you know, watch Twitch like that. Is there any word or anything about blocking ads for like videos? Do you know anything about that? It doesn't say, but I'll tell you this, our data does, or, uh, you block origin, which is what mm -hmm. this is based on already seems to block ads from like YouTube. I haven't oh, okay. used Twitch, so I can't tell you for sure, Uh huh. but it does a pretty good job with it. So, 
We'll have to see, you know. But as long as you use the Chrome browser, I mean, mm-hmm. we're looking on Firefox here because that's what runs a little faster on our recording computer. Yeah. But uh, if you use Chrome, which most of you probably already do, I know a lot that I do, uh, you have nothing to lose. Just sign up. You block all the ads for right now, and then when the the deals are in place in down in the future, you'll make some money off of it. If you're going to have to see ads anyway, you might as well get paid for it. Yeah, that's true. This is a really smart idea. Like, I'm surprised this hasn't come out, like, sooner. <laughs> right. There's no reason why you shouldn't get compensated for this information. They're already paying for it. They might as well be paying you. I know, and that's the thing. You can't really – I don't think there would be any lawsuits or anything that would be able to not make this work because they're already making money off of your personal information. Why can't you make money off of other people's personal information? Well, not really, but like a company's information. Right, absolutely. So, I mean, it's super simple. It's easy to install. There's no nothing to lose, and you get paid for it. So, anyway, that's my Wired Wednesday for the week. I think it's a great service. You should check it out. Sign up using the link below. And you'll get some shares. Mm -hmm. And I'll see you next time we have something worthwhile to talk about on Wired Wednesday.